For the last problem, I want to modify the script to convert the price to euros, and I'll need to look up the exchange rate, so let's go ahead and do this. So currently, one dollar is 0.94 euros, so let's go ahead and put the exchange rate in our code. Let's call it um, exchange rate of euros to dollars. Um, let's call this euros per dollar. And it's suggesting 0.91. Looks like it's actually 0.94. So it's nice to let this be a variable. Then if the exchange rate changes, we won't have to rewrite the program. Now, uh, let's copy the code that we have here so far. And paste it in here. So we're still going to have the same item names and the same prices, and the user is still going to enter a catalog number. But now before we print out the cost, we need to convert the price in dollars to euros. So the price catalog number for the catalog number they choose um, gets to that's going to be in dollars that needs to be multiplied by the euros per dollar rate that's going to give us the price in euros so that looks good and then when I do the printout I am going to have to put the price in euros here instead of the price of dollars and notice it says make the print statement work so there's no spaces between the euro sign and the price okay so I have converted this number into a string so that'll work just like it did last time now here I have a dollar sign I want to have a euro sign the unicode uh, for euro is backslash u and then 20AC. So I can just simply insert that here as an escaped character. And when it gets printed off, it should print the euro sign. Okay, so let's go ahead and try this. Let's buy a Poyute since that costs exactly $1. So a Poyute is catalog number 992. You chose a Poyute, which cost 0.94 euros. Okay, that's great. That's the exchange rate, 0.94. Let's buy a smoke shifter. 19x5 should be 94 dollars, 94 euros. Yes, smoke shifter, which costs 94 euros.